she lives, you know damn well where I am right now. I'm sitting in the library reading books, so if you have something to say. Or are you looking through? Oh, wow, you're going way back. I'm just, I'm looking. I technically don't. No, but that's, I mean, like. I, I can meet, I can, I'll meet you in the library. How to play Pathfinder. <laughs> <laughs> Is that, is, that, is that Hercules Mulligan? This is a tiny Hercules Mulligan. Okay, I'm looking there was for a him. tiny Hercules Mulligan in He's been here the whole time. Delilah gets knocked down. She goes, don't fuck back, don't fuck him! Four sets of courses. <laughs> it's, a, it's a barbarian, then, I think, is what it is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got to work out the yeah, IV I'm, classes. I'm going to go, uh, I'm gonna go meet up with, with, with Percy. I'll let everyone know where I am, too. I'm in the library reading if anybody needs me. All right, anyone else? Wishing to accomplish anything else? Is I'm in the kitchen. <laughs> I want to see if they can make a salad with meat in it. <laughs> if they figure out how, bring some up to the library. <laughs> okay, I'm not very up to up to up uh, yep. positive up up to Grand Poobah. <laughs> If this is indeed your request, they will do their very best to do so, and within an hour or so, you are presented with a bowl of various textures of shredded, cured, and prepared meats yes. to loosely resemble a salad, I guess. A mallet. It's like a giant Poke Bowl. Wait, it's not I a salad it. with meat on it. It is a salad made, made of meat. meat. <laughs> yes. Thin slices. This is far greater than anything I could have hoped for. <laughs> Previously on Hannibal. <laughs> Did you invent this just now? Uh, you, you look at the, uh, the wait staff there, and they kind of, uh, I actually, so it was uh, Chef Varen. And you look over, and you see this, this one, uh, uh, and then you've seen a couple of the chefs in here. You haven't interfaced with them too much. You're not a, a social figure necessarily, more of a, a demanding figure when it comes to the food and the meal. Right. Um, but you see this, this this gentleman with this very like thin kind of Jonathan Waters pencil mustache. Yes. I'm so um, This the, this you know, thinning hair that, that's uh, short but slicked with a bit of a you see pattern baldness going on, and he's a bit a bit thick around the waist, and he's sitting there with a big beaming grin of pride. Chef, this is going to put you on the map. We need to name it. Oh, well, um, Grand Puba, I imagine that would be your honor to give. I am but humble to present you with such a meal, so the choice is yours. Mm. What fine tender meats are in this dish? Oh, well, we've got quite a variety. I wanted to provide um, an, an extravagant walk through the various uh, creatures that we prepare here in Whitestone. So uh, we beyond. have. Yeah. We have. Would you like me to continue? Please, yes. yes. All right. Um, <laughs> I'm talking to myself. All right. We have we have two week cured salted goat meat. Um, on top of that, we have uh, uh, hickory kept uh, long angle smoked uh, fish guts uh, mixed in there with a a, a wondrous mix of of minced uh, uh, steaks. Uh, we've spared no. No possible expense on the various pieces of the cow. Um, and we've, uh, from that point forward, presented a sprinkling of pork belly. Um, it's been ground up and, and uh, salt cured as well over the period of about two months, usually kept to our very esteemed meals, but I thought this was a special occasion. I'm just free so dripping <laughs> saliva, like, <laughs> in and on the plate. So it's, uh, it has a very uh, sedentary layers of the, the planet type feel to it, whereas each <laughs> reveal occurs, it's a whole a different genus of animal. You're eating nature in a bowl. I mean, did you even like salt it or nothing? It's just like all these beautiful animals in my own private ark of a bowl? They came salted. Well, because it's got goat, fish, beef, and pork in it, I'm gonna call it the go Phoebe pole. Go Phoebe Paul it is. <laughs> but look, you have, seem to have like an accent, so look, let's put a little flair on it when you say it. Yeah. The bowl of Go Phoebe Paul. Go Phoebe Paul. I like it. Of, of course, Grand Poop. Oh, and okay. I must decree there will be no utensils used when you dine of this sublime dish. He begins writing these things down. Oh, all right, all right. Um, <laughs> You would need approval from uh, uh, Lady Cassandra, of course, to put this in the the, the familial... Approval? Uh, well, if we were to make this the official meal of Whitestone, that is entirely oh. uh, within... Uh, this just gets better and better. <laughs> Submit whatever paperwork is necessary. <laughs> See that it's done. <laughs> you heard it, folks. 
And poop all smoking. <laughs> Go Phoebe Poe. <laughs> Go Phoebe Poe. And I'll just start like <laughs> hand smashing into my face this delicious salted meat collection. I'm hungry now. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it is delightful. It is delicious. You should not be able to make up food that delicious just on the fly like that. I literally you, you felt like I was at a fucking restaurant. <laughs> <was fine. laughs> that was absurd. As I was saying Grand Poobah, I knew I was like, this is going to bite me in the ass. <laughs> Don't know how. Uh, meat salad, you're welcome. Yeah, it actually sounds really good. I'm kind of and And it's is, is currently being submitted to the Senate of Whitestone yeah. for approval <laughs> <laughs> to become the official dish. Yeah, after every battle, That's we'll get all the protein we need and we will just <laughs> fart our happy asses yeah, off yeah. all night long. <laughs> it's all shabu shabu from here yeah. on. Yeah, I had a constitution check. It might improve your speed. Um, all right, so.